what is really happening because it's it's all a bit muddy at the moment so obviously first things first the big one is the new map we have got caldera warzone pacific it's obviously like a beach style island it looks really really cool um the play style on it looks really 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 good the graphical changes look very very needed it looks very bright a lot of bright greens and a lot of nice colors uh to be quite contrasting to hopefully most of the operator skins which is obviously a really really good thing going to allow the operators to stand out a bit more and help with some of those visual effects and being able to spot enemies from far away while caldera isn't available to all warzone players rebirth island is still available so if you do need to get your fix of call of duty for the next 24 hours rebirth is still available to play but we're also going to be getting a whole bunch of new guns i think it's about 50 new we weapons from vanguard every vanguard weapon is coming over you might struggle for at least the first couple of weeks of the season while it's all being leveled up but there are going to be multiple new modes on this new map we're going to have vanguard br which highlights only the vanguard weapons and vanguard vehicles and we're also going to have a regular battle royale in caldera which is going to have modern warfare cold war and vanguard weapons all in one now the loadout system for this new map does seem to be basically the exact same as what it is now it's still modern warfare perks it's still modern warfare tacticals and lethals um but obviously the vanguard weapons have 10 attachments and will be built in the gunsmith with 10 attachments as well cold war and modern warfare guns are still going to be using five attachments now a lot of people have asked me if they think if i think that the 10 attachments is going to be a good thing or not i don't think it's going to be bad i don't think it's going to lead to overpowered vanguard weapons because of that reason i think what it's going to do you're going to be able to make each gun a lot more specific for the purpose that you want it say you want an stg for long range you've got 10 attachments to build it out for long range and it's only going to be good at long range if you want an stg for sniper support so you want a more up close version you're going to be able to use them 10 attachments to make a much more compact stg but it's going to be really bad at range with the new map is also coming the brand new ricochet anti-cheat now activision have said that this is starting off in asia and australia uh, and that general region to start with on the kernel level side however it will be rolling out shortly worldwide uh, i assume they want to test it within certain areas of the player base first before they roll it out worldwide but we have already had uh, many server upgrades and a lot of upgrades to the current anti-cheat before ricochet kernel level is properly implemented we have also got a ton of new vehicles coming as well as a new battle pass obviously with this is a whole new season we're going to be finishing season six here and going back to season one and this will be vanguard season one as opposed to cold war season seven uh, which means we'll get all new battle pass items which are going to be based predominantly around the vanguard as well as all new store packs as well if you're into the cosmetic style of the game uh, which will allow for a lot more player customization and stuff like that i don't know what depth player customization is going to go into with this i can't imagine it's going to be much more than what we already have but you never know they could potentially add a lot more stuff but later today at 5 p.m uk time i'll put a comment down below uh what time that works out for all of the other countries but 5 p.m uk time uh the new map will be dropping for the first 24 hours it is only accessible for those who pre-ordered or own the full version of vanguard thursday the 9th also in uk time the full version will be released for every every player completely free to play